Hi everyone, this is Daisy Days, and today it's all about popsicles, so I have activities for you, so let's get started. For our first activity, we are using these color sticker dots from the Dollar Tree, and this is a simple and easy um, activity that you could do, which involves matching the colors. So I am going to take a blue one here, put it on my popsicle stick, another red one put space in between let's do this yellow one and this green one on the bottom and also place the same stickers on a clothespin like so I put the same sticker on here you just pinch it down like this and the child will match the color and clip it there. I have a blue one. We'll see which one. And right there. So this is also great for fine motor skills for your children because they have to open and close this and matching. Right there. And we have this one here. If you don't have any stickers at home, you could also use marker. I did this with a marker. And this one with marker. And this is orange. So this is a great activity that you could do, simple and very easy to do, like so. And let me show you my second one. The second activity is missing number. And with my popsicle stick and a marker, I am going to write number one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's leave seven missing. 8, 9, 10. So you will write it and with a clothespin also, we're bringing these back. Your child will find the missing number. So he will count and then you will tell him what number is, is it missing here and he has to find it. When he finds it, you clip it like so. So I did that one. I did big numbers for my older child from 10 to 20 and this one's from 20 to 30. So and then I did the clothespins according to the missing number. So that is another activity that you could do and my third one is the third activity has to do also with clothespins. So this one is you just have to write the letters on the popsicle sticks and it's up to you if you want to do it in order or not I chose to just put all the letters here no order and this is will be for my oldest daughter and they would just find the letter using of course the clothespin so let's see L and the same concept too you find the L and then they match it and then like so so this is a fun activity that your child could actually entertain for quite a while so there you go so this activity is magnet words so I know you probably have those magnet letters at home so grab your popsicles and let's start putting this is magnet right here it looks like tape <laughs> So we are going to put a strip of it on the popsicle and your child will start doing words and this is great if they start doing uh, sight words, let me put it evenly, sight words or learning how to spell, they could use this so the magnet is there now and they could start doing their word. Or you could actually, without falling, there you go, you could actually um, have a word written down and then they would have to copy the word from there. So there you have it. Like so. So this is also a nice activity that your child can do. Very easy. And from there they get start sounding out the letter K -at. cat easy and 
And my last one, I think a lot of people know this one already, but if you don't, here you go. You buy Velcro from the dollar. They sell these dot ones here. You put them on each corner. You could do either on this side, I mean both sides or not. I just did it on one side. And you start start doing things with the, or let your child do shapes or any kind of things they want to do with this just to play around. There you go. And it's very simple too. You just grab your popsicle sticks and your Velcro. You see that? Very nice activity that you could have. And you could put this in a bag or you could put it here in a basket. That's what I do. And your child will love to play with these. These are very nice. And they like to pull them apart also. I think that's their favorite part. <laughs> So these ideas were very simple, very easy to do right at home and I hope your kids enjoyed and I hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe down on the bottom below. I would love to have you and I will talk to you on my next video. Goodbye!